So, so uh, we will start then. Mm. If you if you can annotate, you can annotate. If not, I will just you can just tell me the answer, then I'll just write it down. Then if there is an if you need me to help, then in the aspect that you don't know certain content, then you let me know. So we start with the most basic, what is an echo? What is an atom? You can you can you can have a look at the slides first. I sent, I posted them already. Then you can look through and then you see you can prepare some of the questions first. Give me a second. Eh? One minus one zero. So, so first question, what is an atom? That is the, the very, very basic question. An atom is the smallest particle of an element that has the chemical properties of the element. Mm, good. Uh, so I don't have to write that down. Okay, so the second table. So atoms are made one. out of one. Which one is one? Proton. Yeah. From both is one. Sorry? From both is one. For the relative electric charge, it's plus one. Uh, positive, negative? Positive. Electron. Minus. Minus. Try minus. Electric. Negative one. The mass is also minus one. Hmm? Electron. Mass. Mass is. Mass has no positive or negative. It's a, It's just a number. So for electron, is if you say electron mass is one, that means it is the same size as the proton. Do you mean that? So you, you, you are telling me, you are saying that electron size is the same as the proton size. Am I getting it correct from you? Yeah. Okay. Hey. Then, neutron. I'm just writing them down. Then if there's a need to go through, I'll go through. So, For the neutron is zero. Which one is zero? What the electric charge? Mm -hmm. Then, relative mass. Zero. Zero. Did I get all of your answers down correctly? Yeah. Okay, so let's go back to the atom. The atom is the smallest. Okay. And then we used to have the idea that electrons revolve around the nucleus. And then, ele okay, electrons. Uh -huh. Okay. Da, 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 da. Something like that. So there's a nucleus and then you have electrons orbiting outside. Then in the nucleus there is proton, proton and, neutron. and neutrons. Okay, so 
protons and neutrons are the same size. Oh. Ah, yes. Neutrons and also protons one. are the same, same size. So then the electrons, because they are orbiting outside, they tend to be smaller or rather they are smaller than protons and neutrons. So therefore, um, therefore down here, the mass of this is correct. This is one and this is not one. This is actually um, 1 over 1840, the size of a proton. That means it's very, very much smaller than a proton or than in a neutron. Then, the electrons are negative charge. And then the protons in the nucleus will be positive charge. And neutrons are no charge. So this is fine. Okay, do you need to take notes? I, I deliberately sent you the PowerPoint, the PDF, so that if you want to take notes, you can straight away write on the slides. Okay, next. Can I move on or can I continue? Uh, can I just wait for you to write whatever you want to write? Thank you. Can continue, huh? So, if you look at the next one, okay, now, since I've gone through that, what's, so the diagram below shows the atomic structure of an atom. So the positive charge is denoted by the positive sign, then the negative charge is denoted by a negative sign. So then, in this question, you're supposed to label P, Q, R, and S. P is the electron. Q? Q is the electron shell. Uh, proton. S. Neutron. Okay. 